arena of solution and power. My name is Ejiro Moses. I'm here to return what God has done for me. If I don't know this God of mercy now before, this authentic God, wonderful God, unchangeable God, the God of Messiah, the God who never fail, the God who this possible. Put your hands ah. together for Jesus Christ. This my father is a wonderful father. So the month of September 26, I was pregnant by them. So the last week I came to church. After church, I tell my husband to give me some money so that I can go to my hospital. So I want to go as check up. When I reach there, it is a different thing. Would the woman said you want to give me just that I am in labor? So immediately he give me that injection. I cannot able to walk. I cannot able to move my body. Only way words that come out from my mouth. I tell that woman, call my husband. Then they take me to any other hospital. So that rushed me to one hospital at the Mogalik Road, Money Point. When I reach them, I will already pass away. I have gone. Well, but I am going in one way. The road has no end. When I was going, Papa appeared to me. He was saying that, my daughter, where do you think that you are going? Is it not early for you to go? Revise. I was still standing. When I was standing, Papa had a sick. He was whipping me with his sick. Revise. So I come back to life. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. This is wonderful. So, Ma, we are seeing a t shirt and uh, are you in your hand? Can you please throw more light? Or the high terms you are holding in your hands. This is the anger I'm using. When I was free spirit of death, my mother had already gone how many years ago, came to feed me in my dream. So when I wake up, I say, This is the oil of life. I cannot die. I had to spin down this oil to my mom. I say, Whatever thing I had swallowed in the spiritual ring, I vomit it. So I begin to spin the oil. I also use the oil to pray. I said, this all year will not make me to go down. Because Papa used one word. Say, any member of this family will not go down. So this is the polo that my husband buy for me to wear that day that I want to go to the hospital. When I go to the hospital, is this uh, where I made Papa to appear to me to make me to not die? Hallelujah. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Yes, sir. We are saying a partner's card with you and... We have seen some spiritual items and seen some pictures on the board. Can you please throw more light on the items we are seeing? This partner card here, I'm a junior partner from Mercy City. So this item, then they put us out of water, what I buy, what my, the Spirit of God told me to buy. They said they what buy the polo, buy the, the water of life to give her that day over the good hospital. The picture where you see there, so now the picture where they the hospital where they, they don't play to finish, they don't play to. Now the picture where they say uh, oxygen for your body, not the picture where you say for this. So, for that put your hands together for Jesus Christ. <laughs> what word of advice do you have for viewers all over the world and the people that are listening to this testimony? Mercy land. Arena of solution and my advice. I want to advise everybody of this world. You know, they call the church. Believe the church of Omo Omo. Be believe in the church of Mercy City. It's a real church. No one here for that. If you get problem, if you don't go, if you call law anytime, he go answer you by fire by thunder. He answer me by fire by thunder. I don't believe. Never stand here. So I not just say this year I go stand here. The happy year, I don't believe. He do for me. He go do for you. Believer, call him by name. He go answer you. This advice, I want to give her over the world. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Voilà, certes, les spectateurs, nous venons d'écouter ces merveilleux témoignages de ces couples. Il disait que sa femme avait eu une grossesse prolongée. 
Et cette grossesse a donné un peu de complications sur elle. Et un bon jour, il est venu à l'église avec son épouse. Le Saint-Esprit lui avait convaincu d'aller acheter le t-shirt de la montagne dont vous voyez à l'écran. Et en plus, l'huile de la miséricorde avec l'eau de la piscine de Bethesda et avec l'eau de vie. Et quand il est, après avoir acheté ces matériaux spirituels, ils sont rentrés chez eux. Le lendemain, sa femme a eu des douleurs et ils sont allés à l'hôpital. Et quand ils sont allés à l'hôpital, la situation était tellement grave et tout d'un coup, elle ne pouvait même plus respirer. On l'a mis sur le coma. Et pendant ces commandes, on l'avait ranimée, mais elle ne revenait pas à la vie. Jusqu'à un certain moment, eh, le mari eh, a dit que non, il ne pouvait plus supporter. Il s'est souvenu de ses matériaux spirituels. Il commençait à asperger de l'eau de vie sur elle, l'eau de la piscine de Bethesda sur elle. Et ils l'ont fait boire également eh, l'huile de la piscine de Bethesda. En administrant ces matériaux spirituels, la femme, pendant cette période, il paraîtrait qu'elle partait déjà, eh, elle était déjà inconsciente. Pendant ces moments, elle mourait. Mais elle a vu le prophète Jérémie au moto Fofouye qui est apparu en elle que jeune fille, vous êtes trop jeune de mourir à ces terres, retournez, votre temps n'est pas encore arrivé. Et voilà comment elle est réveillée, elle se retrouve encore au coma. Et voilà comment elle est réveillée totalement, non seulement de ce coma, mais le Dieu de prophète Jérémie l'avait délivré de cette opération. Le mari et la femme, l'enfant a été passé, mais elle est bien vivante aujourd'hui avec son mari. C'est pourquoi elle est ici pour nouveau, à nouveau pour dire merci au Dieu de prophète Jérémie pour ce miracle dans Vie. Applaudissons pour le Seigneur. Christ Mercy Land, Arena of Solution and Power. Christ Mercy Land, Arena of Solution and Power. My name is Isaac Soye, Lokoja from Dorotan, from Bayasa State, and the people beside me here is my mom and our church members. My testimony goes like this. On a faithful day, I was having a traditional wrestling on our school, and, and I was not feeling strong that day, so my mom went to the place and she came back and she was telling me that. There's a lot of crowd there and people that know her. Like for her, it would be a shame to her because she's a coach. She's a wrestling coach. So she now used the pull-up beside her and minister on my head and pray with me. And she said, our spiritual father is a wrestler and that spirit will enter me. So we went there. After we went there, I was wrestling with the boy. Finally, I am feeling strong part than I've not been before. So I now fall the boy on fortnight. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Yes, you can go ahead. So after I fall the boy, I was happy. And my mom said, I, you have seen what the God of Prophet Jeremiah can do. And I told her, thank you. And I said, that the God of Prophet Jeremiah, thank you for what you have done for me. For in Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Okay, for clearer understanding, let us watch a scream and see what the what our brother here is talking about. My brother, that's in the change of watching before. My sister, that's in the change of watching before. Hey, my brother, I'm watching before. Watching I said, you are my light, oh, my heaven and earth. You are my heaven and earth. Yeah, yeah. You are my heaven and earth. Let me be saved. Let me be saved. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Arena of Solution and Power. My name is Rita Amber. I'm a female wrestling coach by Asa State Sports Council. People beside me is people that follow me to the house of the Lord. So the testimony goes like this. Long time that we suffer for motto, for coming to church. I'm the one that even if I don't have money on Saturday, I, will, I must make sure to get money by force. Whether credit or anything. I will pay people to come and worship and go back. That is how I, I was doing before. So later, 
there is time that the thing now tired me. So I now pray to God. I pull my shoe at the motor road there. I pray to God. Say, God of a woman, woman. And every Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I use my leg to win souls. So I now say, God of a woman, if you want me to win souls to serve you, please release moto for where I live with Obele stroke Ogo Ayama Road. God of a woman, I now shout as I shout, making the three days. The God of Omomo provide motto for Ogu, Obele stroke, Ogu, Oswale, Anyama Road, all that side, motto free going and coming. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Yes, for clearer understanding, let's watch our screen and see what our mother is talking about. This is the evidence. You can see the bus. A mom is talking about, you can see the people she brought here today, the boss she prayed for. And God of Sino for Fujima Omoto fame provided the boss for them. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Yes, ma, for what the God of Sino Prophet Jema Motofe has done for you and your family, what is our advice to viewers all over the world? Mercy Land! Arena of solution and power. No, why, when you stand, ask. When you believe your prophets and you join the faith, no matter any eye delay, at the end of the day, it will come to pass. We believe, even we are in Marsh's leg, when you believe the sun, we are in Marsh, it will come to pass. Hallelujah, Merci put Lord. your hands together for Jesus Christ. Voilà, chers téléspectateurs, nous venons de suivre ces merveilleux témoignages de cette dame dont vous voyez à l'écran. Elle croyait dans son ministère des personnes qu'elle gagnait chaque reprise pendant qu'elle partait pour l'évangélisation. Mais l'effectif ne fait qu'augmenter. Mais il n'y avait pas suffisamment de véhicules pour pouvoir euh, transporter ces personnes pour venir ici à l'église. Et voilà comment un bon jour après l'évangélisation, elle a prié dans la route que le Dieu des prophètes Jérémie pourvoie un véhicule pour nous pour pouvoir transporter ces personnes jusqu'à l'église. Après trois jours, elle a reçu un appel et euh, la voiture qu'elle avait priée était bel et bien arrivée. Et c'est ce qui fait en sorte qu'aujourd'hui, elle est venue avec ses membres dans ces véhicules dont vous voyez à l'écran. Et c'est pourquoi elle est ici pour dire merci au Dieu du prophète Jérémie pour ses miracles dans leur ministère. Applaudissons pour le Seigneur. Merci, Lan. Arena of Solution and Power. Merci, Lan. Arena of Solution and Power. I'm by name Margaret Order from Nassau State. The person beside me is my mom, Mrs. Patience Jumei Ode. The problem that brought us here is the issue of difficulty in walking that my mom has been having. For the past five years, she always complains about walking. She cannot move inch and inch because of that. Every time she will put her hand on her waist and complain, sometimes she will cry. And so, we came here to Christ Mercy Line because of this issue. And on Friday, in the evening session, at the pool of Bethesda, God of Prophet Jeremiah located my mom, and he prayed for her. And immediately he laid hand on her and prayed for her. My mom, that could not be able to walk well, stood up, and she started walking, praising God, Giving all honor to the God of us, you know, Prophet And you are just sitting there like that. Pain. Somebody stand on your feet and make a joyful noise unto the Lord. Now you see that there is no way you're here. Because many of you witnessed it. It was indeed a miraculous one. Celebrate grace. So, for a clearer understanding... Let's watch the playback on how a mother regained herself and received her deliverance and healing. This tablet not for you. That's in the change of You 
50,000 Jeremiah Motor Free Foundation Open your hands Rub the parts that pains you Let your testimony be permanent in Jesus name. Amen As you celebrate this testimony And as you celebrate this healing Whatsoever that has been giving you sleepless nights May God give you testimony over here Our mother can stand now Do what you cannot do before Majestically You can see mama go back Happy, she's now walking like 16 year old lady. Somebody put her hands together for Jesus Christ. So our sister with what God has done for you and your family, what word of advice do you have for viewers all over the world and for those that are sick and believing God for their healing. If you are all over the world, I want you to see what God of Prophet Jeremiah and what of fear have done to the lives of our mother. Believe in him. Believe in this great commission. Wherever you are, you should try and come to Mercy Land. No matter how the sickness, you come here, you receive your healing. We thank God of Prophet Jeremiah, and of the faith. May God continue to give you more grace, more anointing in Jesus' name. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. Voilà, certes, les spectateurs aujourd'hui est un sujet de joie pour la vie de notre famille, dont vous voyez à l'écran. Et elle disait que précisément sa mère était malade pendant plusieurs années et elle était sur traitement avec tous ces médicaments dont vous voyez à l'écran, mais elle n'arrive même pas bien marcher. Et ceci fait en sorte qu'on l'avait conseillé de venir ici à Christ Mercy Land pour chercher la face de l'éternel. De manière précise, vendredi dernier, l'homme de Dieu, prophète Jérémie Omoto Foufouye, l'a vu localisé et il a prié pour elle, aspergé l'eau de la piscine de Bethesda sur elle, à l'instant même, elle s'éleva et commençait à marcher. Aujourd'hui, ce qu'elle n'arrivait même plus à faire auparavant, elle peut le faire, elle peut faire ses mouvements comme il se doit. C'est pourquoi elle est ici avec sa mère pour dire merci au Dieu de prophète Jérémie. Applaudissons pour le Seigneur. Put your hands together for Jesus. Mesila. Arena of solution and power. Mesila. Arena of solution and power. My name is Janet Olabi from Cross River State. The person beside me is my beautiful daughter and my friend. My testimony go like this. They operate my daughter, come there, this old momo. So they operate her one week before I leave for the place, for the hospital. When we go there, they play the come uh, on blood. Every morning when they dress her blood. Now now has the uh, doctor say, doctor, when my daughter uh, operation is like this, he say, ah, he no no say na like this, he be you say tomorrow morning. He go take out another operation that he forget something inside. That's how he forget something. He say yes. I say okay. I've been now carry pull up the side of water. Go to the hospital. And I say I'm a partner. Go to Jeremiah. Me I care to know what doctor is say. What I forget something. What I not forget to me I care to know what he forget. But come on that thing when a doctor live inside. So I know my daughter don't enter the second operation. As I carry the pull up the side of and mix them together water of life. I, I want to spread to my daughter body. You know, she said, Mommy, no, no, no. Don't tell her she knows spray good water. I say, No, this water is not the ordinary water. And I spring the water for the operation all. The following day, the doctor come in the morning. So, yeah, you go with me down to go to the theater. My daughter moved. I say, God or Jeremiah, go before my daughter. When my daughter go, he goes sit down there. Small time. He did the, oh, me, I come, they say, Why don't I enter the theater? Oh. Small time she come back, say, Waiting, doctor, talk. Doctor open the wound, check everything. Say, Everything is dry. Nothing like that. I say, I'm not to the theater. Everything healing. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ once again. For a clearer view, we have some pictures. Let's take a view at the pictures so we understand what our mother was trying to explain to us. You can see the place that uh, was operated. It was a CS. And then 
our God perfected everything to his glory. Somebody celebrate grace. Our mother, with what God has done for you and your daughter, please, what word of advice do you have for viewers all over the world? My advice will be over the world. Believe in God, or no prophet, Jeremiah, or Motofui, and be a partner. Your case will settle. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Voilà, chers téléspectateurs, nous venons d'écouter ces merveilleux témoignages de cette famille. Elle disait que sa fille était en grossesse et, et étant enceinte, et la, la grossesse était un peu compliquée et ils sont allés jusqu'à la faire accoucher par la césarienne. Et après cette opération, l'endroit qui était opéré, la plaie était vraiment difficile à être guérie. Le docteur donnait des, des plaintes en disant que non. Il avait oublié quelques matériaux d'opération dans le ventre. Et voilà comment eh, ça donnait encore des puits et du sang dans ce lieu. Et donc, quand ils avaient donné cette euh, affirmation, la maman était inquiète, elle continuait à prier. Elle est obligée d'aller prendre des matériaux spirituels. L'eau de la piscine de Bethesda, dont vous voyez à l'écran, avec l'eau de vie, elle a mélangé des déseaux et administré ça sur l'endroit qui a été opéré. Et après quelques temps, trois jours après, le docteur a dit que non, ils vont revoir encore pour l'opération. Et quand ils sont rentrés dans la salle d'opération, après quelques minutes, le docteur est sorti. Il dit non, ça ne vaut plus la peine parce que l'endroit était totalement sec et la plaie est déjà partie et voilà pourquoi ils sont venus aujourd'hui à nouveau pour dire merci au Dieu de prophète Jérémie pour cette guérison divine qu'ils ont obtenue, applaudissons pour le Seigneur Arena of solution and power. Mercy land. Arena of solution and power. Mercy land. Arena of solution and power. My name is Beatrice Eze. I'm from Ben West State. The person beside me is my daughter, Uzomaka Eze. My testimony goes like this. Military, my leg, March, Mercy land. I didn't know Mercy land before. But as I reach here, let me just say I escape I reach for the church. Because what is following me is too much. When I was coming here, I didn't tell anybody. Because it's like before I will go, my house problem will follow me reach there. And my problem will not be solved. But immediately I reach to mercy land. God of mercy. God of Papa J. God of Jeremiah. He there with me from the mercy land. My first miracle for the mercy land that he was doing program. From that program that week, I reached here on Monday, Friday. When that he preached from that pool finish, I was jumping. From that jumping, when I was dancing, celebrate what God did to me. When I jump, go down. Now from there, I fell down. I faint. When I faint, I thank God for Papa J that located me. I don't know what happened, and I cannot tell what happened. They took me to hospital. From that hospital, Papa located me in my when I was sleeping. Papa located me, wake me. My daughter, wake up. He called my name, Beatrice. Wake up. When I wake up, I follow Daddy in that my dream. When I follow him from that gate to the hospital, we see six people from the Lord. As we see six people, they was attacking with the asking daddy question, and daddy was asking them. They said they came now to kill me, to finish what they start. They must finish what they start. Daddy asked them, say, who are you people? They said they want to kill me. Daddy said, no go kill him. no go kill him. Now, daddy was praying. Lion from nowhere. Lion bite two through where. And they were still fighting with daddy. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Our sister. And they were still fighting with him. Lion from nowhere. Lion jump again. Bite two through where. I hide from daddy back. When I hide from daddy back, from there daddy pray. And I wake up. 
Because me, when they carry me go to hospital, I cannot walk because the doctor said it was a stroke. But that night, after I woke up, I stand up myself. Nobody carry me up. I woke up and I Somebody stand up Somebody put myself. your hands together for Jesus Christ. Second testimony. When we did for Martin, they pray. Small time, my husband called me that my daughter is missing two days. Now I say, God, if you can heal me, you will bring my daughter back. I go for the pool. I lie down there. I was crying. Calling God or Papa Jay, God or Jenny Maya. If you can heal me, you will bring my daughter back. Wherever we are, my daughter day. Bring her back. I was crying. I carried her picture to my phone, to Mountain. When I reached there, little Jeremiah was praying. Now he located me. He told me that this girl, they in serious problem. Now God will bring the girl back. He began to pray for the picture. That's why the girl come back alive. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Let's watch the playback. Come, can I talk to you? Where is this baby? Because the baby is crying to me now. As I turn like this, the spirit just appear. He lost two days. Is he your baby? Yes. Is he your baby? Yes. Is your baby? Don't worry. God will bring the baby back. Amen. God will bring the baby back. Are you hearing me? Amen. Father, I declare and declare upon this picture. The same way you set Peter free, set her free. Amen. As I touch you, you will come back here for a testimony. Amen. In Jesus' name I pray. In Jesus to me pray. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Let's hear from your daughter. Please share with us your wonderful testimony. Mercy Land. Arena of Solution and Power. Mercy Land. Arena of Solution and Power. Mercy Land. Arena of Solution and Power. My name is Eze Uzamaka. I'm from Enugu State. I'm here to give a testimony. On one faithful Tuesday. I was going to church with my girlfriend. So, when we reached the church, she told me that she wants to see her guy, her boyfriend. So I said, I said, uh, I want to start going home. So, she, according to my friend, she was telling me that let me wait. There is still time. So, I left her there. On my way coming home, I saw a man. The man stopped me and told me that he's not a Nigerian man. He came from outside. He wants to say he's good. So, if I can help him to count Nigerian currency, so me thinking, the man said that he's going to give me money and phone. So out of pity and because of the condition I'm passing through, I decided to follow the man. When I entered the keke, the man told me to take a oath. After taking the oath, the man said that we should go. So reaching there, the sister was not around. So and I asked the man that this oath that I will take, is the goat going to affect me? The man said that it's going to affect me. I said, okay. Then the man had told me to pour spit on my hand. After pulling the spit on my hand and telling me to turn the back of my hand, after turning it, I saw the spit at the back of my hand. Then I was afraid. The thing took me off. So the man answered, if I tell anybody this thing, I'm going to die. So going home, he dropped me at home. He told me to go to my house. Any money I say at home, I should bring it and give them. So I went home, packed all the money. My dad ATM card, the two of them, I brought it for them. I told them they pin, they two pin, and they will do all 50,000 naira. My grandmother, I bought her 10,000 naira, and my grandfather phone. So we were going, so they dropped me at one side. They collected the money, they collected everything. Then I told me to go outside the keke and count po seven times. And they told me to not look back. So going, I counted the po seven times. When I came back, I entered the keke. Then inside the keke, I went off, I slept over there. So waking up, I saw myself in the bush. And in that bush, there was, like, my mates, they was cutting their private parts. So, I don't know what they were using them to do. So, I was afraid, praying, and I was crying there. So, by God's grace, when the man said that they should bring me, they brought me. So, the man started saying that they should take me away from me. I'm not the right person. So, in the night. Somebody stand on your feet and give the Lord a shout. So I was in the middle of the night, so there was nowhere for me to go to. So I slept in an uncompleted building. 
Then the next morning, I saw a keke man. I told him to take me back home. Somebody put your hands together for Jesus Christ. <laughs> Give us your word of advice to viewers all over the world. We know solution and power. I advise everybody from the whole world where they are watching me. Should hold the God of Maryland, God of Jeremiah, God of Papa J. I never know him. I follow him through TikTok from Benue State to this place. And when I come, what I saw in front, I see it live. And it happened to me. Know why you're here. Everybody, when you are coming here, come with free mind. And our God is working here. If God can bring my daughter back, if God can heal me and I stand like this, God can do everything in this ministry. In Jesus' name. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. Voilà, certes, téléspectateurs, aujourd'hui est un sujet de joie pour cette famille. Et de manière précise, la maman disait qu'elle est venue ici à Christ Mercy Land pour chercher la face de l'éternel à cause des problèmes dont elle traversait. Et pendant qu'elle arrivait à Mercy Land, au cours d'un programme de la piscine de Bethesda, elle louait l'éternel en train de danser. Tout d'un coup, elle est tombée. Et quand elle est tombée, elle est devenue maintenant inconsciente. Et quand elle est revenue encore à la vie, elle s'est retrouvée déjà dans l'hôpital. Et tant dans l'hôpital, on l'avait dit que non, elle s'en allait pas. On l'avait donné euh, sur la perfusion. Et tant dans cette perfusion, on l'a traitée jusqu'à un certain moment. Elle était maintenant rentrée en, en, en transe. Et dans cette transe, elle voyait des personnes qui se présentaient pour pouvoir la combattre. Et tout d'un coup, le prophète Jérémie au moto Foufouille est apparu. Il a dit non, ça c'est ma fille, ne la touchez pas. Il commençait à la défendre, elle se mettait derrière le prophète Jérémie au moto Foufouille. Et tout d'un coup, il voyait encore de part et d'autre des personnes qui commençaient, des géants qui apparaissaient pour pouvoir la combattre. Et le prophète Jérémie commençait à combattre ces personnes et tout d'un coup, le lion de la tribu de Jida est apparu et ce lion a dévoré toutes ces personnes qui sont venues la combattre. Et tout d'un coup, quand elle se réveilla, elle était maintenant à la vie. Et voilà comment elle était d'abord sauvée de cet, cet accident spirituel dans sa vie. Après cela, elle est venue encore à la montagne pour intercéder, pour chercher la foi de l'éternel. On l'avait appelée, que, écoutez madame, votre fille est déjà kidnappée. Et donc tout d'un coup, elle était traumatisée. Elle a pris sur sa, son, son portable, fait sortir la photo de sa fille. Et pendant ce temps-là, c'était le prophète Jérémie euh, Junior qui rendait ministère. Elle, elle s'est plainte et il a pris son téléphone entre ses mains. Il a imposé la main, prié pour elle que votre fille ne va pas être dans la main de kidnappeur, mais elle va sortir sain et sauve. Et voilà comment, après la prière, la fille était bien sortie dans la main de kidnappeur. Aujourd'hui, elle est ici vivante avec sa fille pour dire merci au Dieu du prophète Jérémie pour ses miracles. Applaudissons pour le Seigneur. Put your hands together for Jesus. Merci là. Arena of Solution and Power. Merci là. Arena of Solution and Power. My name is Husman Abdul from Kogi State. My testimony comes like this. I came here last month on the 25th. Then daddy located us in a Besaida. So the following day, he prayed for us. I went to my state. So along the line, the money daddy gave to me, I used it to invest in farm. So as they make the ridges, I was spraying the chemical on the farm. So the, the chemical now pour on my back. From there now, penetrate to my brocos. Everything water to scatter. So they took me to hospital. They said they should take me to our state capital hospital. I said I will not go to any hospital. They should keep me in my house. So there is a little water I left here with and with the Anki that daddy gave to me. So I started pray with that Anki with some drugs and some injection. With God intervene. So mercy of God now come upon my health. So the fifth day, I'm in my room. I, early in the morning, somebody was knocking my door. I said, who is that? Uh, he answered me, say, it's my wife. I said, which of my wife? I don't get wife. Wife, where don't run since you? They tell me, say, my wife. He said, I should open the door. Say, she's my wife. I said, okay, calm down. Nowhere. Make I take, take easy. Open the door. I opened the door. I saw my wife through, through with my picking for her. 
I say, ah, ah, na, na me this year be na charm. Waiting carry you come back. She be now you tell me, say, you know, they marry again. You run, come off from my house with my picking. For how many months now? Almost seven months. Why you come back? He say, make a no verse, say, na devil walk. Make I look aside again. I can't see her mother close to her. I say, ah, ah mama, wait till they happen now. He say, he get charm when me and they do, then one die. They know they sleep with my picking. In the night, then know they sleep. I say, come, I don't throw everything. I know they do charm again. No. But God, who are they serve now? Get power, pass on our God. I can't collect, come out the necklace ready for my neck, put for my picking neck. Now I then say, now for almost two months now, then they carry my picking, go every hospital. They help no green, come back. Now I say, talk. How which my picking die for no green? Now, person picking day with you now, I know where. Even though I know they marry your daughter again, if you carry my picking, come meet me. So, now the mama come, they beg me. They say, man, they carry my picking, go hospital. I say, no, I still carry this the same water, I give my picking. As he drink, now I can't send my sister. I go buy drugs, come and some medicine. Following day, my picking come to play. So reaching day before yesterday, <laughs> reaching day before yesterday, and now I can't tell them, say, I won't travel to worry. Even the mama said, oh, then I won't go back to village. Anytime when me, I won't come carry my wife. Make I come back, may I carry my wife and my picking. So the reason why I come with this picture is this my brokers when nearly everything nearly come out, where God help me, where anything no can do I'm again. Now I manage myself, come testify. Put I your hands God together for Jesus name. Christ. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. To know the word of advice you have for viewers all over the world, for what God or Papa J has done for your life. For what I only know is that there is no any other God to serve than Jesus Christ. I will advise my fellow brothers and sisters to go and serve Jesus. God of Papa J is real God, no be fake God, the original God. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. Nous bénissons l'Éternel pour la vie de cet homme qui l'ennemi avait affligé avec l'esprit de la maladie sur son, son fils. Et son fils, on l'avait amené de partout pour chercher des soins, mais il n'y avait pas moyen. Et jusqu'à ce qu'on eh, l'a amené chez lui, lui, il avait administré l'eau de la piscine de Bethesda sur son fils et son fils a recouvri sa santé. Et en dehors de cela, lui, il avait aussi quelques problèmes de santé. Il est venu ici à Christ Mercy Land. L'homme de Dieu, prophète Jérémie au moto Foufounier, l'avait localisé. Il a même béni avec de l'argent. Il a pris cet argent d'aller acheter des produits chimiques pour pouvoir faire des agricultures. Et pendant qu'il était en train d'asperger, faire euh, sur son champ, et le produit était tombé sur sa vie privée, sans son organe privé, ça lui avait donné carrément des problèmes sérieux. Et il est allé pour les soins partout, pour faire des soins, mais il n'y avait pas de solution. Il a administré également l'eau de la piscine de Bethesda sur sa vie privée et son organe privé. Et voilà comment il a obtenu sa guérison divine. C'est pourquoi il est ici à nouveau pour dire merci au Dieu de prophète Jérémie. Applaudissons pour le Seigneur. Merci Land. Merci Land. Merci Land. My name is Dokas Osas from Bini. My brother will make me come from Edo State. I know where. Are they sick? Now one day like that, I faint. My daughter rushed me to go hospital. I stay for one month and three weeks for there. Are they looking? The problem not they solve. And they look at the problem not they solve. Now me and my daughter discuss and say, get us a bill. And we don't get money. My daughter go borrow money because I did sick bed. And they, they draw us for the money for them. Now I say, carry me the come Mercy City. Carry me the come Mercy City. Oh, now here, and now I know before. Now here I will survive. I don't know what did happen. Now my daughter carry me come here. Before I come, my two legs swell up. I asked the doctor for there, what happened? What happened to me? He said, one sickness, he called her. Say, one thing, don't chop all my heart. All my heart, don't chop, finish. Say, now nah, make me, my legs swell up. I say, ah, I don't get uh, this one. Will not be me, get this sickness. If I come, Mercy City, where my papa did. 
the sickness go go by force. Put your hands together for Jesus Christ. And so now I have to come here. Before we come up for Bini that day, five o'clock, they never pray. Because the person when my daughter go borrow money for her, he no let her dress. They never break. Now we carry back. They come to side. We run come up for us. I say, not be in my head, I will first talk first. Now, so we take on here. Since a day here, since I they manage the body, but nobody they understand. Some people, when they still know me here, they, they see me. They say, ah, the way you be before, not be so you be. I say, now God. But that day, or Thursday, I don't know what it happened. The sickness got, it got too over strong. I know if you walk, I know if you walk, I know if you stand up, I know if you talk. I they call they carry me up. Now my daughter can carry me, go pull up beside that side. People they pray, are they there? I know if you talk, I know if you raise hand, I know if you raise them. I say, God, better they hear what the people they talk. Before I look, I tell her, I talk to my daughter, I say, come. I'm not sure I will make him again. I say, Bill, I say, don't finish him. He called a cry. He said, no, what happened? Our father, they yeah, nothing will happen to you. Before I look, people, they walk out, they pass me. People, they walk out, they pass me, they pass me, they pass me, they pass me. They come, they ask my daughter, what did they happen? My daughter says, see, what did they happen to my mama? He said, I know, I say, daddy, daughter, did they, yeah, nothing will happen to me. Now my daughter caught the shot. As Papa, you touch me. As Papa, touch me. Somebody stand on your feet and give the Lord a shout. You may have your wonderful seat. Mama, please go ahead. They are calling to my daughter. I say, what well, Papa Professor? Say, he hear cry. When he won't close. Say, hear cry, oh. They hear cry, oh. Because they hear cry, they hear cry, they hear cry. That time, my daughter, they cry. I don't even know where I did again. I don't do the other side. I don't do it. But one thing when he surprised me, when I won't talk. When the body don't strong, when, when, when I don't do the worker, I come back and say, I want to use myself. The spirit of God just talked to me. He said, go, my kind of side. The altar, dear, where your papa, they preach, he sees. He said, go there, go like that. As I like that, dear, that image of God, Jesus Christ, when he did it, he just appeared, come. He waved it to hand. He waved it, they waved, they waved. I'm not quitting because I closed my eye. As he waved, he said, my son, he did around, you know what we'll die. He said, you know what we'll die. And he said, get up, they go meet them for pull up, they that. Now get up. I tell my daughter, I say, Oh, yeah, where would they go? But I don't go feel work. Huh? He said, I ah, want to do now. I remove my slippers for a leg. My daughter pack her. He began to draw me the follow leg hand they go. As Papa John touch me. As he carry pull up beside the water turn for my face, turn for my body. Now everywhere for my body. Now I raise my head. My body can they begin to vibrate, they shake. From there, now my heal it restore what it now. And you are just sitting there like that. Somebody stand on your feet and celebrate grace. All right. Let us take a watch of the playback. I'm hearing the cry. I don't know what's going to happen tonight. There is a woman crying right now. In the realm of the spirit, Lord says, if you leave that woman here, that woman is going to buy before tomorrow morning. There are others alive, but one of them that I'm seeing right now, they says that you will not cross 4 a.m. this morning. The name starts from D. I'm seeing D. Dogas, I don't know. It's written on their caskets. Dogas, Abi. Yeah, she's there. Let me see. What happened? She has been sick since last year. Last year. God of Papa J, help me. God of Papa J. My mother is dying. God of Papa J, please help me. God of Papa J, help me, sir. Let the girl, the girl run. Run to the pool. And the 
beside the water now. King David is life changer, worship him. King Solomon, life changer, worship him. Out of Israel, life changer, worship him. I'm not a man with life changer. The poor man shall not pop up, he rabbi. The poor man shall not pop up, he rabbi. So what it is, the Lord of I don't know where she come from. They said from Benin City. Not be so. From where? Benin. You are coming for second testimony. Yeah. Worship him more. My brother, let's change. I worship him more. My sister.